so I mean, there's always the debate of gi versus no gi. I yeah. mean, what what's a uh, maybe for somebody who doesn't know the difference, yeah. right? Um, I would say gi is slower paced. Okay. And it's a lot more technical. Okay. It's generally better for beginners and older people. Gi. Yeah. Gi. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Because uh, the grips slow everything down. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No gi. A lot of things like you gotta like be quick. You gotta have really good timing. Okay. You do need super good control, but uh, you can think people get really slippery and stuff like that so it's okay. a lot more like yeah. dynamic and explosive okay. yeah like because obviously ufc is is there's obviously no gi right, right so, yeah yeah okay that makes sense yeah and uh, yeah that's yeah. cool so i think 10th planet is you know where you you did you start at, i mean you didn't start but you, no, you went start. to 10th planet right, right? Like, well it's so. more like um so I, I trained at this this gym simia martial arts sure which, okay uh, let's keep i think they changed that. their name to their team moriera now okay and moriera is like a super old school red belt coral belt or something like that now oh really yeah, he's one of the like original wow yeah guys oh, that's cool I, I trained under a coach under him okay okay and um i don't know i trained there kind of had like a little falling out with some students and okay. so i went sure, with sure, another sure. guy okay and uh he was a 10th planet uh brown belt okay so i think he's a purple belt at the time okay and uh we started like a little club and then slowly that turned into a 10th planet we call it hot box Okay. It's not like an official gym. Okay, okay, okay. But cool, yeah, it's cool, still cool, 10th yeah. Planet. And we were under a 10th Planet ba- Black Belt. Named okay, Rick Marshall. okay, that's cool. Yeah. Okay. And so. That's f- So. That's how is 10th Planet like no uh, no gi strictly? No gi only, it's always yeah. no yeah, gi, yeah, right? No okay, gi, yeah. so that's what I thought, right? Yeah. Okay. So is there, if there's a no gi, is there a belting system with that as well? Or how yeah, does that, that work? That's a, it's kind of controversial. Yeah, yeah okay, yeah, because yeah, yeah. I'm curious. A lot I mean, of, some of the gi people like, they were like, oh, you. You don't know what a collar choke is. How can you be a blue belt <laughs> oh, <laughs> or something shoot. like that? Okay, you know? okay, okay. Which I kind of, when I was training, I kind of thought it was BS. But now, as somebody who teaches gi and no gi, okay, okay, yeah, uh, yeah. I find that like I'll have some guys who've been training no gi for like a year, okay, and they'll come into gi and it's like they look like a white belt. Like, okay, like, okay, okay. Like brand new. The so skills I'm don't like, transfer over as well as they should. Or? Some, I mean, most of it does. Right? Would the you start movement. from one to the other? Which one would you yeah. think would be the best to start uh, with? Gi. Yeah. Gi start. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah. okay. Because that transfers over. Unless well. you're like a young, super athletic. Okay, like super. Like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> then yeah. you probably you probably like nogi more. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Uh, but yeah, so I kind of get it. The belting system's the same though. We same? just don't okay. do stripes. Yeah. Oh, okay. Because okay, you don't okay, okay. have a phys- well, There's no I mean, belt I do have a physical belt. Okay. The, they, they usually give you one, but it's just more like ceremonial. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So. Let's grab the next one, man. Yeah, yeah. The yeah. next one is a chipotle. 